All right, let me go grab my horse. Ooh, I want some more of that. Give me the thistle! What's in the news? Have a clean stable has to be some interesting news. Matriarch revitalizes Kakarika Village. So nice survey team turns eyes to ring runes. Okay, yeah. You guys the treasure hunters, or...? Okay. Just need my horse for some towing, please. Oh yeah! We got tons of beetles. We, we got like a bunch from when we fought the trees. So, uh... For me, I'm honored. Beetles and play favorites. If I did, it'd be beetles every time. Ooh, did beetles eyes deceive him? Bladed rhino beetle. Mighty elixir is a fair trade. All right, sure. Five minutes of attack up. Nice. Wow. Oh, take care of this, sweetheart. Okay, so you only do one a day. I, I do not want to buy those. Okay. Good to know. Alright, let's go grab that Korok, slap them onto the back of this, and ride them wherever they need to be. Where are you going, kid? Dude, he's like a mile away! Like, alright. I'm curious what Koroks need so much travel supplies for. Is that Lizolfo? Uh, I don't really need Lizolfo parts now, but I probably will eventually. I love how this is the solution that's just like the best, just drag Korok behind horse. I saw the sign guy a while back. He was over in... Oh, maybe that's what I pinged over in the uh, other area. It was sign guy. I couldn't figure out what that ping was for, but that makes more sense. Yeah, these guys are just greens. We can kill these guys really quickly. If I could actually shoot for shit... even hit your shield. Okay. I forgot I had the flamethrower shield on, but that kind of works.
Okay, I was trying to practice my flurry attacks. I don't know what that man is doing inside there, but we're just gonna cut the rope. Yep, that's usually the right solution. Oh, did not know you had a tongue attack. Okay. I was trying to be all fancy and use my uh, reflect attack and stuff on him. Or my, not my reflect, the uh, flurry dodge. Damn it, kid! Trying to practice here on enemies that are not a threat to me. Ooh, that tower is real close. go for the tower, or could just grab this shrine teleport point, and then come back again. Yeah, I know, I'm getting too distracted, so that's why I'm trying to minimize my distractions. That's unpleasant. And it has seen me. And apparently it's a blood moon night. No. Time we're windy around here. Just want to get the teleport location so I'm close to the tower. Uh, I suppose we should go grab the tower then. Oh yeah, I need to... Uh... Mark that dude. <whistles> like a bat creature roost or something? Or those Lizalfo?
Damn it. Ooh, there's a fallen star. We got some guts out of it. A few new bows. Come on, give me give me the power. Yes, nice. Wasn't even expecting that. As you usually don't get to see the effect because you're not in view of the sky when fighting Phantom Ganon Floor Master. Makes sense, makes sense, yeah. Because the last time we found them, we were, they were in a cave, so. Get oh, fuck, that's not a regular tree. I didn't know they could be apple tree things. Interesting. I don't have the photo of the tree monster. I probably should. Hey, look, there's Sign Guy. Let's go say hello. You know, add one more distraction to our path anyway. Oh, this time he built a platform for me. That saves me some trouble. and use this cart for the base. Is that a skeletal Hinox over that ridge, or is that a dragon? All the signs are unique? Oh, dang. You know, points on him for creativity. That's a lot of signs to make uniquely. All right, give me some money and some food, please. Thank you. Ooh, some stealth up rice balls. Nice, nice. Hey, bomb flower. That's the one I want every time. Oh, it's not a skeletal hinox. It's one of those uh, shrine thingies. I think that's the one down on the south plateau. Silent shroom. Ooh, nice. That one was very sneaky. <laughs> oh, how'd I miss that thing? Um, cancel. <laughs> Ouchies. Well, I hit him. Good to know when the bow breaks, you sit there and you fall to your doom instead of letting you have a chance to put other things out. Was this actually a cave? Shit.
Ooh, this axe has a big old gust of wind. Nice. I thought the Eagle Longblade did a vacuum, but I guess that just means it's a air blade thing. I was assuming it was like a draw an enemy's close kind of mechanic, but no. So there must be another secret path somewhere, because I'm not seeing the uh, the big guy. The bubble frog. Yep, there it is. I swear these caves are like most of my stock up of items. Shield the mind's eye. Decrease blind spots without sacrificing too much defense. I mean, it's better than this one, I guess. I really don't utilize shields nearly enough in defensive capacities. Hey, Alex! Thank you for the raid, and welcome! You know what? Hoping for a little bit bigger effect there, but... Wait the fuck? Where's my bubble frog? Ugh. Link. Ouchies. Bubble frog. Oh, here we go. Man, this one was mean about giving you stuff. claymores.
Yeah, no, I figured out the, the, the base weapon effect thing, yeah. And that was mean. They made you go through, like, a mile of stuff to find this stuff. Actually. Why am I walking out of a cave? Oh! Man, that's convenient! Oh, hello. You come to see Skyview Tower? My apologies. Looks like we have a small problem over here. But the terminal of Skyview Tower needs repairs, so I came to fix it, but... Door won't open. No clue why. Door isn't locked, but it won't budge, no matter how hard I push or pull. Oh, of course, I know it's a sliding door. That's what I meant. Obviously. I worked up an appetite getting my brain into gear for this, but I bet the nearby caves would have some tasty mushrooms. Caves at the bottom of the hill. I used to go mushroom running in them while we were building the tower. Sir? Need like a mighty shroom? My apologies, yeah. Oh. Okay, yeah. Or do you want me to just pop up from underneath? Because I can totally pop up from underneath. Okay, let me do this. Okay, now I have a pin exactly where I need to pop up. Should be right in this room. Ah, it does let me come up the inside. Oh! Ah. That's hilarious! Door's open. Repair the thing so I can go launch myself in the sky and then get back to the quest because I keep getting sidetracked. Uh. No big problems, a little oil clear right up. Gotta hurry on heads, this is goodbye. Well, thank you, Bilson. It's been a while since we launched ourselves into the sky with wild abandon. This area's got some fun sky ruins. Holy shit, look at that. Is that the main plateau? That might be the main plateau. Dang, it really put us up here. Ooh, wait, I've been over there. I remember that island, I think. Maybe not? No, I don't think I have been over there. <gasps> There's a gotchapon machine! Alright. Going to the Gachapon machine, then we're coming back. Or then we're going to the next shrine. Because now we have a teleport point, we can go up out of that hill and fight that Talos whenever we want. Uh, 
Oh, shit. This is one of those crystal shrines. Can I use teleport point still without solving it? Yes, yes, I can. Excellent. Good. So where is the beam? Oh, it's over there. That's unexpected. Okay, that's a little bit easier to get to than I was. What the fuck is this thing? What? That's cool. So I bet you this is how I get it back, is I turn it, turn it again, and then I have to get back to the device from here, yeah. So I want to have this thing turned. And this will give me a nice free heal, which I kind of, sort of, desperately need. <laughs> Golden apples? No. don't know if I put this on the bridge if it'll fall off or not, so I'm just going to walk it and do it the slow way. But honestly, I could have left it on the other end of the bridge and just turn the entire bridge to have it move the right way. So, you know, two options for this quest. I'm taking the, uh, the one that's not going to fail but might take a few seconds longer. Close enough.
All right. That was actually interesting. That showed me a different room inside than was actually inside. All right. What does this give me? All right, we only need to do one more shrine, then we can hit the depths. I've got a few more that I could do, but I've taken almost two hours to, you know, wander off on side paths. However, there is one more side path I want to wander off because there was a giant hole in the other island and a giant pusher thing that sent me to that hole. So I want to go see what that was about. Also, the uh, gambling. Gotta go do my gambling. Okay, maybe a second side detour. Alright, gotcha pawn machine. Show me your goodies. Where's my Zonai cores? Should have a few of them somewhere. There they are. What do we got? A ooh, spring contracts and expands with enough power to bounce objects away from it. Cannon fires shots in intervals. The shots explode when hitting the con target. It's a powerful device, but it can be tricky to, to get the firing angle just right. Um, yeah, no, we're a. Uh... Gonna buy a few of these. Go set a penny for every time you got sidetracked, you have at least $100. I mean, that is what Breath of the Wild is. It is the adventure of sidetracked. This was an excellent sidetrack, though, because now I have cannons. Stop. Stop doing that, Link. I'm trying to go through this quickly so I can get moving along and, uh, yeah. <laughs> Not giving me a lot of cannons, is it? I got nine of them. And that means I can... <laughs> yes! I love it! I love it! Did not mean to fire that again. Let's put that away. <laughs> Cannon shield! I gotta upgrade batteries? I have not found... I, I guess I could teleport back to that forge. Oh, I see a chest underneath. Mm, 
doing too tempting. Okay. One thing at a time. Oars, then center thing, then chest. Oop, wrong way. Oh, so there is a castle in the sky over there. Launch me! Sage's will? What? The remnants of a former sage's resolve. If you gather four of them and offer them to a goddess statue, you can deepen your connection with the sages. I don't even know what the fuck that is. But it sounds cool. Maybe I need them to have more than one uh, sagey person at a time or something? Second forge on the starter island. I visited the regular forge. I don't see another one on my map, but there's a forge construct there, and then there's the crystal refinery. There's also a crystal refinery right back in the base. Oh no, 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 no. Ouchies. That usually doesn't hurt me. <gasps> Hardy radish. Nice. Yeah, Skyon's got all the good shit. Okay. There's the chest. That's what we're doing last on this island.
Old map. Nice. I don't think we've had, yeah, because all these old maps are in the depths, so we have not explored any of these old maps. Oh. Of course. Also, killer, welcome. Oh, there we go. I'm gonna mark that mining island at least, because that was the most dense mining spots we've ever found. Let's see, is tonight a blood moon? Where's the moon? It's been a little while since we've had one, so we're not too far off of the next, I don't think. There's Zora's Domain. Where the fuck is the moon? Oh, there it is. Normal moon night. Alright. Big hearty radish. Hell yeah. Okay, let's go do that Korok, and then we need to do one more uh, thing, and we're done. We're in fucking Kakariku. Alright. I caught a star on the way down. I didn't catch the Korok. But I caught a star before it hit the ground. And now I'm in Kakariko Village. Um. What the fucking odds of that? Or is that what that's supposed- No, it can't be that's a star thing. That was a Korok thing. I'm also really bad about remembering how to dive. Um, well, damn, um, I did not really want to be here this early, um, but I do see some more gambling, and, uh, kid, oh, I can't fucking use the kid during the inside of village. Well, at least I have a teleport point here now. Not what I expected, but I guess this could be my eighth shrine. Oh, but I am here in the static starting again, so let me, uh, unlock the shrine and restart my thing. Yeah, that Korok zipped by. All right, we're back. Yeah, two star fragments. All right. Well, I'm going to go check out that after I come back out. But I need to go finish this shrine real quick, and then we'll, uh, yeah. Point of the story where you're at isn't too early, though there's an area in the village that is story locked. Yeah, no, I just wasn't planning on getting over here, but I just randomly dropped onto it. So, like, I guess we'll explore the city a tiny bit, maybe buy some stealth armor. But I want to go do the depths, so... Oh, I totally did not read what the shrine is. An upright device. Okay. Thank you for having the subtitle. Oh, it teaches how to use stabilizers. Good. I was curious about that. I'm assuming they just keep whatever they're on upright. Wait, how am I supposed to fucking get over there then? Alright, game. Alright. It's upward force, not keeps it flat. Uh, 
Oh, it always tries. Oh, ah, did you... it's a weeble wobble thing. It'll wobble, but not fall down. I get ya. Well, now I know how to use these things. All right, that's fun. That's fun. All right, I understand. <laughs> Launch me. It's the Link Spatula. Hmm, I'm not getting the height up I need on this. Oh, because I'm not supposed to go over there. I'm supposed to assemble things from over here. I getcha. Oh, it's heavy when that ball is not actually attached. That makes sense, though. Really? Really? You're gonna... Okay. Yeah, get in the hole. I'm just gonna wait. I'm patient. Getting less patient. Get in the hole! <laughs> okay, now where is my damn treasure chest? Is it back by the entrance? I bet you it's back by the entrance. Where you have to use that, like, original flipper to flip yourself back to the entrance. Oh no, it's over there. Oh, okay. Well, that works. Um, off? Not want that at an angle. There we go. All right, the Link Flipper two thousand, the ultimate in spatula technology.
Womp. <laughs> Ooh, fairy tonic. All right, I'm gonna be needing that soon. Up, up, and away! Whoosh. Oh, here we can see what they look like from the top. You could have gotten into this cage without catamaling with the use of a sand. No, you couldn't. Or, oh. I guess maybe if I'd stood it up and ascended through the platform and then jumped the cage, yes. Because I was going to say, the, the, the cage didn't have a platform to ascend up to, but yeah, I see. Oh well, we got our eighth one, that means we can go grab a heart, get us those ten hearts, get an extra stamina capsule so we can climb better, and hey, we're in Kakariko Village. Did not mean to go this far over to the side, I was just climbing a little hill... And apparently the tower was just real close to town, so. Let's go uh, play ga with the gamble machine. Ooh, what do we got here? Great fairy fountains, maybe? Uncertain. Album is full. Damn. Okay, I was about to say, I'm like, when is my album gonna fill up? So... Actually, we're gonna keep the bloopy, because that might be quest-relevant. Fairy might be quest-relevant. I want to keep that, because that's, like, an awesome picture. Nope, I need that one. There we go. I cleaned up the album pretty nicely. Some interesting ruins going on over here. What do we got? Southern Ring Ring Research Journal. Um, like the other ring ruins, those that fell to the plateau south of the village had a stone slab with Zona inscriptions. Curiously, we discovered a flower growing in the rune likes of which we'd never seen. Into text reveal is Sundaline, plant long thought extinct. Currently borrowing a local plum orchard for our cultivation efforts and hoping our studies prove fruitful. Our investigation of the round device filled with strange objects has come. Meanwhile, I come to a standstill. Well, first off, it's gotcha pawn machine. So, yeah. Hey, I like trains. Watch all the Friday the 13th. Mmm. That was a fun series. Alright, let's see what we got. You know, I kind of suspected some stabilizers. Ooh, we got wheels! Okay, okay. I'm gonna spend some money here. Now we can build wheels things whenever we want. Still need to get control devices. That's the one thing we're missing from our uh, capsules.
Alright, cool. Alright, we got the Shrine Teleport Point here. Let's go see about a shop. Probably should go to the town entrance, because if there's going to be a cutscene, that's where they're probably expecting me to show up. No? No one's looking for me? Alright. We're hands on with the ring runes at last. Can't believe it. Uh, Lady, this chunk is a small piece of one of the ring runes. Nothing much, really. Compared to the main sites, like that ring rune over there, it's broken in two. You can still see the full ring. Can't visit that one by order of Princess Zelda herself. No one's allowed to go near it. Is this like a giant railgun? I hope it's a giant railgun. I'm getting close to this chunk here or something at least. We can sweep up some of the fragments, sneak them away. We gotta study these runes somehow. Uh -huh. Don't mind me, we're just definitely leaving everything as I found it. Oh, the survey team. Uh -huh. Thought we were gonna get yelled at again. Now I'm uh -huh. Link. Finally, we want to become members of the Sony survey team, so we came here to study the runes. You know, the rune rings have been found in Kakarika Village and nowhere else. Okay. We have a great opportunity to learn all sorts of things. Letty is running all over the place. Look at this and that, so we've gotten nowhere fast. After we're done here, we'll see a stone slab found in each of the ring runes. Huge discoveries, they say. Uh. Alright. How many of the five ring runes we can visit to see? Alright. Cook pot over here. Hey, grandma's health isn't going to. Ugh, and Claire's so busy in the clothing shop. Do it myself, find a cure for my grandma. Let me know, what do you need? I got a ton of random crap in my bag. It doesn't really matter who you are as long as you li really listen. My grandmother got too close to that nasty gloom stuff, sick and bedridden. Porridge is about the only thing she keep down right now. If you can help with gloom sickness, none of them had any effect. With the porridge, it'll make my grandmother better and need to do it soon. Alright. Okay, chasm on the east hill. Million rice, fresh milk, wild greens. Okay. Can I just steal crops or they get pissed at me? Might get recommended if you take it. Got it. 